Hi, my name is Sana Saeed and you're watching me on MissMalini.com. Well, that's been a very long journey and Anjali was, I think, 14 years ago. So, I was a kid back then, that was just an opportunity that came by my way, which I only realized today how big it was after, you know, doing a comeback again with Karan. And well, Tanya is a lot of fun. It's um, it's a movie that I'm working again with Karan after 14 years and I'm really, really excited. And I really want everyone to be very lenient with my performance because I'm really nervous about it. I think it's amazing. No, actually, I'll genuinely tell you, I'm somebody who I thought when I would enter, I would not be able to judge the film because, you know, when it's your baby and you work so hard, you can't come out saying, I didn't like the film. But I genuinely feel that we all loved it. It's amazing and I just hope this does fabulously well. Karan is, is just too good. He rocks. He's killed. It was very easy to work on it because, you know, one, you're working among an entire new team. So everybody is like given the space and time to work your lines, you know, say it the best you can. And of course, it was a lot of fun. I don't think we were, anybody was above 25, 27. We were a complete young team from like actors to AD. So it was a lot of fun. Everything just like happened, you know, in play. It was easy. Yeah, it was good. And Varun, Sid and Alia are just very talented. They look fabulous. They're doing a good job. They're great dancers. It's just everything good about them. Oh, I don't remember any funny incident, but uh, I think the best time that I had in the movie was when we shot for the disco song because it was the last song of our schedule. Remo is fab. He's given us like the best hook step we could ever ask for. And you know, the whole um, thing that, you know, when it's your last thing, you want to give it your everything. So everybody was out there giving their everything. The vibe was perfect. We had a ball shooting the song. So I don't remember anything funny exactly, but I'll, te I'll tell you, like, this was one of the most fabulous things I lived on the movie. It's definitely Disco Divane. It's my favorite song. And uh, of course, I love Vele also. In fact, we started, we love, we all loved Vele. A, a lot but you know when we had that hook step come in and we had the choreography and it became this prom number I think this was definitely my favorite song. I don't know see I that was my character and I was you know dressed according to it I was made up according the makeup everything so I think you're calling me a diva I'm very happy because that makes me happy I think I lived up to it then but apart from that I think I'm more fun and bubbly and I'm you know less all diva-ish so it's not that close to me, but you know, of course, dressing up well, getting out is something that is always with me. I take it with me everywhere, so that part of it was easy. My favorite movie, like currently, I think Barfi is my favorite movie. I loved Barfi. I loved Ranbir Kapoor. He's awesome. He's one of the brilliant and PC. She's so good. So I think, like currently, that is my favorite movie. I love Rani Mukherjee. She's my all-time favorite. I'm waiting for Aya. I can't wait to watch it. And uh, actor, I'm uh, well. There's Shah Rukh and there's Salman and there's Amir and in current it's Ranbir. Well, I've done the movie right now. I'm just waiting for a release. I'm waiting to see the you know the feedback because I'm actually so scared. I don't even know what to look forward to because this is just like so different. This is something I haven't done in a very long time. I did do TV sometime back, but I was not close to this character or what I'm playing in this movie. And it's a Kejo. It's a movie with him again. So there are no future plans. I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna wait it out till I get something really good and then go ahead with it.